everyone, this is Camille. Today, let me teach you how to improve your barring drone footage or long shot footage into something with a great sense of depth, like the opening shows. If you are into this topic, keep watching. To make this effect, I recommend you use some high-definition footage. 2K, 4K, and 8K footage are good to go. As for the visual content, it can be the shot of a static scene, or we can use the shots recorded by the drone, moving up or rotating slowly. After getting the footage prepared, let's open up VideoProc Flagger and start the edits. In the first place, we should import all the footage we need onto VideoProc Flagger. You can click on here and then select the target footage. Let's add a video number one to the video track. Then click on here to enter the motion editor panel. Click on here and add a first keyframe at a position where we want the effect to start. Here, based on the footage, we can adjust the selected range of this box and change its size. Then let's move the playhead to the position where we want the effect to stop. Add a keyframe at this point. Then let's restore the original state of the footage. Take a preview. Hmm, we're almost there. But we can notice some unwanted gaps showing over these positions. To fix the gaps, we need to add more keyframes, adjust the rotation angle and the zoom speed. Let's move the playhead to the position where we'll show the unwanted gaps. Then we add a first keyframe for fixing that gap. Make small adjustments to avoid the gap. Based on the footage, we can add multiple keyframes to get a better result. This will be okay. Last, let's choose Speed Up as the speed mode for the first keyframe and choose Speed Down for the last one. Take a look. Hmm, we now get rid of the gaps. Suppose you forgot or failed to record the footage by controlling the movements of your drone in a desired way. This method may save your shot. Here I use this piece of footage as an example and show you how to make it look like a rotating and moving upward drone shot. Let's click on here and enter the motion editor. Just like what we did before, click on here and add a first keyframe at the position where we want the effect to start. Then, based on the footage, we adjust the selected range of this box and tweak its size. Because we want to make it look like a rotating and moving upward drone shot. Here, we rotate the footage with a larger angle. Then let's move the playhead to the place where we want the effect to stop. Add a keyframe at this point. Next, we restore the footage to its original state. Take a preview. Hmm, 
we get the wanted effect. But also, there are some mistakes. Let's go to the position where the mistakes show up. Add some keyframes. Then we tweak the size of the selection box to fix the mistakes. Take a look at what we get. Hmm, nice work. That's all for today's tutorial. Just try it out yourself. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for getting the latest news and tutorials from VideoProc Flagger. You can go to the homepage of our channel to find more awesome video editing tutorials. See you in our next video. Bye!